Hi guys, welcome back to my channel F Shake Excel Master and today we are going to learn VLOOKUP with a simple trick called Triple W. Yes, Triple W is very helpful trick for the beginners those who are using VLOOKUP. So let us quickly jump into the example and see how are we going to do that. We have a set of data over here okay, which has our customer account number, name, address, amount, gender and another set of data where we have the account number and we like to pick up the name we look up can only read the data from left to right it can't read the data in the reverse order from right to left that can be only possible with match and index function which we will be covering up in our future tutorials and so let us look for the vlookup so vlookup can only read the data from left to right and we wanted to pick up the name and amount name and amount and this is a system syntax which is available so we look up we wanted to do we look up look up is this table array column index false table array is nothing but this is an array where we'll be selecting the range and column index is the one which column we like to pick it up from that range so what is this triple w triple w is nothing but it's a very simple way to remember the formula what i am looking for where should i look for what i want if you remember these three things what i am looking for where should i look for what i want then vlookup will be really easy for you equals to vlookup what I am looking for I am looking for the account number where should I look for this is my range this is the place I should look for I should lock the range it's very important because I need to search in this range if I don't lock it once I track the formula the range will change so we need to lock the range and what I want I want the name so it is true comma false enter Wow, here we have it equals to VLOOKUP again. What I am looking for, I am looking for the account number. Where should I look for? I should look for here in this range. I lock the range, comma again. And what I want this time, I want the amount. So my column index will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, comma false. Here we have it. Write the formula down and again we copy it here. Now I'd like to explain you in detail regarding the column index. Okay, why it is important that each the range what we are selecting from that represented the column index. So if I'm selecting the range from here, starting from cell A, this is my first column, second column, third column, fourth column. But in case if I'm selecting it from here, then my range is this is my first column if it, this is my range then this is my first column second column and third column so with the help of VLOOKUP equals to what I am looking for I am looking for Kareena Kapoor now my range is I am selecting from here comma what I am looking for the amount comma false you must have seen this time my column index I have selected as 3 because my range is starting from here. But in this case I have selected 4 because I have selected the range from here and the pickup value was the account number. But this time my pickup value is the name. So the, where the name is starting from that range I have counted 1, 2, 3. This is my third column. So, I, so let us quickly look again into the triple W what it is what I am looking for where should I look for what I want what I am looking for where should I look for what I want and then it will become very easy to do the VLOOKUP calculation so I hope you guys you like this video so please do subscribe my channel share the video push a like button for this video and if you have any queries please write back to me signing off for the day F Shake Excel Master